guys, AJ Monte here, aka Andrew, and today I'm bringing you a tutorial, news, and interesting stories. Um, the main aspects of today is cloud storage and hacking dodge. For those of you who have not heard of either of them, cloud storage is basically online backup um, storage that's provided by companies for free or paid for. And I'm going to go through a couple that are free and are very good. Also covered in this video will be information about Hackintosh. So what it sounds like is Macintosh and that's true it is. Hackintosh is basically running the Mac operating system on a PC hardware. So that's like if you've got a desktop PC that's got maybe a Intel Core i3 and you've got a motherboard or some RAM and you can shove, well with some special steps you can shove Mac OS X on it and it, um, it'll run like a Mac, which is very useful if you're doing data backup or you want to run Final Cut or edit or anything like that. So I'll go through that later on in the video, but first what we want to do is you want to go to Google. Um, same process as always, open up Google Chrome, so I'm going to open up a new tab. And the first um, piece of software I'm going to go over is Google Drive. Now, um, Google Drive is basically cloud storage um, and it's it's for documents and it basically you can upload just about anything to Google Drive. Um, I'll show you Google. So you just want to just want to go into Chrome. You want to type in Google Drive and it'll take you to Google Drive. But this is what I've got in my Google Drive. I've got backup of my USB, some operating systems and stuff like that. But if we go to the home page, it'll let me. Open the home page? Nope. Yeah, it won't let me open the home page. Anyway, what we want to do eventually is you want to, you want to actually, you want to download it. If, if, you, if you want to use it, you want to download it. And it's available for iPhone, iPad, Android, and desktop or Mac. And you get for free, I think it's five gigs a year for free. And then if you want to um, get more, you need to pay for it. But we're not, we, you can look, we can look at the pricing and see how much stuff costs. So if we want, um, so you can pay monthly for it, uh, you used to have to pay a one-off fee but you can't anymore. So if you want to have monthly 25 gigs, you can pay $2.50 which is around a quid or uh, 125 or something like that. It's, it's, around, it's around, uh, around about 150, £1.50 per month and you can have 25 gigs for free. Or um, if you want to have 100 gigs a month, it's around about 450, well not 450, like 350 um, and it goes up, it's in dollars but translating it to pounds is quite cheap um, uh, so here it is, still up to 5 gig in Google Drive, 1 gig in the full bit and 10 gig in Gmail for free and pay for additional storage as your accounts grow, here's how it works okay so basically you download Google Drive, install it and it appears on your desktop if I can find my desktop Oh, where's my Google Drive? Right, I'll, I'll show you. I, I've, I've not got it on my desktop, but it'll appear on your desktop and I come like this. And all you want to do is double click on it and it's got all your folders and you can you can back up, you can back up stuff. So say, I don't know, I'm going to back up my Windows 8 keys. You just drag it into the folder um, and it, it'll, it'll start to sync it and you get, a, you get a wee kind of sync icon and then you get a wee tick. So that is Google Drive. The next one, um, where are we? There we go. The next one I'm going to go over is Dropbox. So I've got a special deal with Dropbox. Um, you get two gigs for free when you click through my link. So what you want to do is you want to go to my YouTube channel, and if you're already watching a video, so if you're already watching this video, all you want to do is you want to click this big button here. Is your one? Oh god, too loud. But you want to click the big button here and you come to my YouTube channel. Do you want to click the purple tab which says Dropbox? Yeah, it'll take a little time to load up. And then you can just type in your details, sign in, nice and simple, nice and easy. And you can download and you basically create an account. It's the same idea as um, Google Drive, but it's more for documents and uh, laptops and things. So that's really useful. The other one in which I've only just started using is Live Drive. It's it's good in terms of you can you can back up uh, loads of loads of stuff. I think you get 25 gigs for free, which is 
really impressive because the other two are five gigs and two gigs. Uh, but still. Hello. Hello. Um, still they're doing a tutorial. Oh shit! To say. Hello. So, sorry about that, guys. Um, yeah, Google Drive, uh, not Google Drive, Live Drive is basically a uh, Live Drive, okay? Um, it's it's provided by uh, Microsoft and it gives you 25, no, oh, no, it's not, my bad, right? It's basically, it's, it's, it's called SkyDrive, sorry, it's called SkyDrive. It's provided by Microsoft and it's 25 gigs for free. The only downside to it is you can't upload more than 300 megabytes at a time. So say you want to back up ISO images and stuff, um, you can't. Well, you, you can't. You can't back up. Um, you can't back up more than three gigs at a time. So you need to split stuff. So um, that's cloud storage. If you've got any questions, uh, send a message on YouTube, on Skype. You can add my Twitter, follow me on Facebook, whatever. Um, you, if you just click through the bars on my YouTube channel. Um, the next subject I'm going to be covering is Hackintosh. So, for those of you who don't know what Hackintosh is, uh, I'm going to explain to you right now. Hackintosh is basically the concept of running, I explained it to start briefly, but the concept of running Mac operating system and Mac programs on a PC. Now, most of you would think, oh, a PC is that not just Microsoft? Well, to be completely correct, yes, it is. Um, P PC is a term developed that was developed by Microsoft, but we're in going to incorporate it here. So, in order to run Mac OS X on a PC, you need a the following things. You need a program called iBoot, which you can get from this website here. I will just show you if my Google will load up. So, you want to get iBoot. And you get this from Tony Mac x86. Tony Mac is the site in which developed this this thing that was enabled you enabled you to um, have a Mac operating system on a PC. So you need basically I'll I'll provide this link in the description and what you want to do is you want to check your hardware is compatible first because that's probably the biggest thing. If your hardware isn't compatible there's no point in even trying to install it. So yeah once you've got your stuff you can follow through this tutorial. Um, I might even do a tutorial later on in um, another t in, in another episode if I if I have enough demand for it. If not, then you guys can just follow this tutorial and you can go through it yourself. Um, thanks very much for watching this video. Um, I announced briefly in my other video, but I will announce it again for those of you who didn't see my last video. Go and check it if you haven't. It's on Windows 8. Um, I am now officially partnered with. Uh, a company called RPM which run an app called Social Blade. Now most of you who have used, uh, who, who, most of you who are YouTube people and always check out your views and stuff who have used Social Blade, um, well they've got a partnering scheme and if you get a thousand views for a day um, they'll partner you. They're, I think out of all the networks I've dealt with they're the quickest, like quickest turnaround. I think I got my channel partnered within a week and I've got people that have been wait I've been chatting to people on Skype who've been waiting for well over a month. Um, the rates are quite good as well. I haven't got their rates to hand, but they're very good. Um, it's round about, I think it's like two pounds per thousand views, uh, which is, I mean, it's not bad. Um, certainly a lot better than Machinima. If you're a first first party, uh, first party, first time partner, so you're not being partnered for very long. Um, also. The other advantage of being partnered is that I now have a banner at the top of my channel and I have lots of links so if you want to click them and have a look. I also have a second channel that you should all go and subscribe to which is called AG112 Tech Tuts. It, it's linked on the top of my channel as well. And thanks for watching guys. Um, please rate, comment, subscribe and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.